Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we are playing the Pope. Here in the opener of Salus 4. In the last episode, we vassalized Naples, and they're happy with us. They're like, yay, we love being the Pope's bitch. Uh, we also... Uh, well, we pieced out Venice. They're still in the coalition against us, but we pieced out Venice, and we made France give three more provinces to our wonderful vassal Provence. So... High five to us. I'm really happy about that. And I'm, I'm starting to think that maybe we should just annex Provence while we have them this big rather than maybe having them lose some land. The problem is they have this land over here which is discontiguous. So they will never put down rebels over there, ever. So even though they have a core over here in Baroy and they have it until another 60 years of it, I don't, I don't think it's... Um, I don't think it's going to flip to our dudes, you know? It's too bad, though. I would have loved to have it flip to our dudes. Uh, but in any case, uh, if we annex them now, we're going to be forever hated by France. I mean, that, that hatred is never, ever, ever going to go away. So we're going to have to rely on our allies, Castile and England, to get our back, so to say, uh, in case France comes after us, which they most definitely would. I'm getting some weird lag right now. Why do I lag? No, I'm sure you guys are seeing the same lag that I'm seeing. It's weird. Anywho, why don't we get out of here without even fighting France's rebels? Because those are Catholic zealots. And I would prefer to not kill Catholic zealots. You know what I mean? Do we not have access through Savoy? You're my ally. Give me access, you lame sack of shit. Okay, good. Okay. Genoa left the coalition against us. Very good. Uh, everyone go home. Everyone go home. Good. Okay, good. We're not going to get out of there in time, are we? God damn it. And we're in exile mode. It's fine. Okay, you guys, make sure you go home through Limousine. That way you won't kill the rebels. Don't kill the rebels. Hopefully France will flip back to Catholic. That would really make my day. Why is my game lagging? Damn it, game. I don't know. Okay, okay. Mm, Castile's got... Like 30,000 douchebags over here. Wow. How many can we have? We can have 54. We have 45 douchebags? Holy shit, we have a lot of dudes. I approve of having this many dudes. So anyway, we're going to get all of our diplomats home. We're going to see if we can't... Um, well, I can't afford any more alliances. We are way over... We are nine, we're at 9 out of 4 relationships. Holy crap. It's a good thing we are annexing Mantua, and we should soon... When can we annex Ferrara? When can we annex you, Ferrara? Next year. Oh, okay, good. Let's start getting relations up with Ferrara. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get relations up with Ferrara so that next year we can annex them. Uh, can we give them a small gift or something? Just make sure we annex them next year. Oh my goodness. Decisions. Uh, nothing amazing. Keep Aragon out of Italy. Yeah, that's going to take some time. Improve relations with Naples. We're definitely going to do that. So do that. Um, why not? In fact, can we do that right now? We can do some of it right now. Sure. Relations. Yeah. Get relations up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And hopefully these rebels... Hopefully these rebels will be able to um, deal France uh, some nasty blows, if you know what I mean. Nasty blows. French blows. Uh, okay. You guys are regrouping. Why don't we take everyone else to Ancona? You guys can group up over there. We are currently converting Liguria from Protestant to Catholic. And once that's done, we can core it. Uh, okay, can we get, like, a statesman or something? Make this go a little faster? We could, but he's a level 2. It'd be too expensive. Never mind. Better relations over time. That is fine. Uh, prestige. I don't need prestige. And the only other guy is production efficiency. Do we have much production efficiency? Not really. Urgh. Maintenance. I guess he's pretty good. Now nah, we'll just keep our current advisors. How are we on admin tech? We are super advanced admin tech. Can we even get the next level? Yeah, we can, but we're seven years ahead of time. Holy crap, we are so fucking advanced. Uh, level 14, we get another idea group. Okay. 
And you can send someone down over there. Yeah, I know. I know. We're only getting two Diplo points a month. I know. I know. We need to annex some vassals. I know. I know. Mm hmm God, Swiss peasants. Well, you can cancel access with friends now. You are right. Thank you. I never would have remembered that. <laughs> Thank you. Although we may need it if we annex Provence. If we annex Provence, we'll need it. Hmm. Hungary, Burgundy, Cologne, and us. I'm trying to think if we could attack Savoy and get away with it. Hmm. We do have a free diplomat. Why don't we see if we can't get Venice to like us a little more? Because they hate our guts. Come on, Venice. Let's be buddies. Let's be pals. Wow. Oh my god, Bavaria is the target of a big coalition. Austria, Hesse, Saxony, Salzburg, the Palatinate, and Mainz. Bavaria is huge. And someone's even voting for Bavaria. Wow. Most people are still voting for uh, Bohemia, though. Interesting. He's in a big war, though. With, with pretty much that coalition, yeah. Okie dokie. Should keep on doing some buildings, though. Let us... Ooh, I really want that embassy. Nah. Let's get taxes up. We have so many freaking admin points. Get taxes up. More money. Is that a loan? We have a loan coming due. Oops. Oh well. Are we still funding the troops? We got stop funding the damn troops. <laughs> Ooh, a cardinal died, and he never even made it to the Curia. Shoot. Hmm. We could go for someone cheap. Yeah, let's go for someone cheap. Almost done with Mantua. Can we get Ferrara? Is it that time of the year? Um, I think we can, right? Yes, we can. We just need... Um, Fleet basing rights? No, that'll that'll improve my opinion of him, it won't improve his opinion of me. What can we do to get ten points with him? We're already improving relations, but I'm not sure if we're gonna get it before Oh yeah, yeah, we will. Before December? I think we will. I think we'll be fine. I wanna start the annexation before uh Mentua finishes. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. July, August, yeah, we'll be fine. Getting to a month. There's nothing else we can really do. We already gave him a gift, right? Yeah. Well, I just hope it works. That's what she said. It's going to be cutting it close, that's for sure. If it doesn't, we just have to wait a little longer. It's not the end of the world. Lose prestige or have some peasants revolt in Cremona? Uh, well... I'd like to keep my prestige if I can. Kill the peasants. They are dead. That was easy. <laughs> sir, sir, the peasants are dead. We're not going to be able to do it. Oh man, we're going to be one point off. 
He's gonna next in December. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, he didn't actually annex in December. Hey, it was wrong. It's 100%, but he didn't actually annex. So we you did get Ferrara. Them. You can't guarantee a vassal. That's right. All right, Mantua. He came in on the 2nd of December. So we started the annexation of Ferrara on the 1st of December. The day before Mantua was annexed. I love it. Oh, that worked out real well. Come on down here, dudes. Please. Please. No. Damn it. Oh, we can tech up. Uh, do we want to do it this year or next year? I'd rather do it next year if we can, but I think we'll have too many points. Well, we can spend some points right now. Heaven forbid we have too many tech points, right? Shit. Our grand captain died. Damn it. And we can't even afford a replacement. Uh, what would we go for? Manpower, morale of armies. Probably morale of armies. Morale is just amazing. Okay. And what can we do with our diplomats? We're improving relations with Naples. Herbiterbiter. I think we should just annex Provence. I hate to say it, but I mean... It would get rid of another relationship. Although we would have to get access to France somehow. Mm. And it would give us a border with Aragon. So they would hate us. But they already do hate us. Oh my god, Castile leads a union with Portugal. Wow. Well, I hope Castile wants to stay our buddy. Because um, we... Wow. Wow. And Burgundy still has us as a rival. Why does Burgundy have... Why do the Ottomans have us as a rival? That's awkward. I guess we should put France in there, huh? Everyone has France in there. Let's put France in there. France, you are a rival. There we go. I don't even need Genoa in there anymore, do I? Uh, bu 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 bu. Wow, Bavaria is getting fucking owned. We probably should ally with Bohemia if we can. Hungary would be good because they're Catholic, but Hungary is just so weak in every game I play. They're just weak, weak, weak. Even Ukraine might be a good ally. I don't know. I would prefer Burgundy over anyone else, but they have us as a rival right now. Well, it's improved relations at least. Uh, we already have enemy of enemy, but who can we put in there instead of Genoa? Aragon, I think, is a good enemy. Uh, it's too bad Castile doesn't see them as an enemy. Mm, Poland, maybe? God, Poland's just getting fucking wrecked up there. Ooh, England has Aragon. That's nice. Hmm... Naples has Byzantium as a rival. Oh, Byzantium's actually getting some land back. They got Corfu back from Venice. I think we gave that to them, yeah. And then they also have uh, Rhodes, so good job, Byzantium, for existing. Herbiterbiter. I think... I think we can do the Teutons pretty safely. That'll help us out with Bohemia, even though the Teutons are Catholic. Well, I don't know. If the Teutons are going to be badass, maybe we should use them as an aid against Bohemia. Hmm... I just don't want to constantly have to fight Bohemia, and I certainly don't want to have to fight Bohemia if they get allied with France. We'll put Poland in there. Poland is never a bad choice. Poland cannot into space. Poland likes the hell out of us, too. Or we like Poland a lot. They've improved relations with us, that's why. Oh well, tough luck, Poland.
Bad luck, Poland. Eh, just one loan, no big deal. And our inflation is still going down. Good. Not by much, but good. <laughs> Must help Byzantium? I don't think so. They're fucking orthodox, man. Why would I help Byzantium? That doesn't make any sense. We're the Pope. Max out relations. Okay. France is threatened by us. I like that. Let's bump relations over here. Okay, improve relations with Naples. We finished a mission. What else can we do? Improve defenses in Romagna. Enemy of enemy, Austria. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Keep Aragon out of Italy. Convectal Act. We're never going to get Austria up to that point. They took us off their shit list. Fine, but even at max relations, we're still going to be hated. I mean, I, I can try. It's better than nothing, right? And when January rolls around, we can hit the tech up button for our admin tech. Wow, we make so little money. We need more money. Are we using our trade boats to trade? Oh, no, we're not. We're not even using our trade boats. Oh, my God. What the hell? Why are you guys not telling me about my trade boats? What the hell? You guys need to tell me this shit. <laughs> the onus is on you. Okay, tech up. Fine Arts Academy, all right. Ah, oh, we can now do our military tech, finally. That means new units. Oh, freaking hell. We finally got to tech level 10. New units. Gallo Glay is going to upgrade into... <sighs> Land Schlechten, I guess. I don't really know. Latin Knights are now Schwarze Reader. Okie dokie. And Large Casperon is now going to be a Culverin. Hooray! Go, units! Oh, yeah, man. Just putting our trade boats out there doubled our income. Holy crap. Let's go for the uh, improved defenses in Romagna, and let's do that. And if you guys are seeing any lag now, it's not you, it's me. For some reason, my game is just chugging, and I don't know why. I think I will do a restart of the, of the game after this episode. I said that like four episodes ago, and I never freaking did it. What was that, a personal union? No, something. I don't know. User in your channel, oh, Hesse your agreed channel. to religious unity with the Empire. That's what happened. So Hesse has been forced by the Emperor to go Protestant. Well, fuck you, Emperor. How dare you? Force religion on the emperor. <laughs> yeah, we could. We freaking could. More temples, more taxes. Yeah. You didn't miss anything, man. Relax. <laughs> we, uh. Oh, Bohemia is demanding things. I don't think so. Don't make demands on me, Bohemia. Wow, he has a lot of allies. I like this. We have a Catholic alliance. And then there's like a huge uh, Protestant alliance as well. Oh man, I need some money. I'm missing out on an advisor.
Ooh, Castile and Aragon are at war. I'm going to get drawn into that, I can tell. Aragon, Austria, Serbia, and Genoa. Oh yeah, I'm going to get drawn into that. Okay, get the fuck out of there. Come down to Siena. Uh, who's attacker? You're attacking. The Castilian Aragonese excommunication war. So he's still excommunicated. That is hilarious. I like that though. It means um, it means they're not going to like each other, which is good. Austria, no, you cannot have access. And mm, they're still allied with Serbia, Austria, and Genoa. Hopefully, hopefully Castile will make them break up their alliances. I don't like them having that alliance with Austria. Uh, no, not more temples right now. I need my advisor. Better relations over time. Sounds good. When can we start annexing you, Naples? Okay, we joined the war on Castile's side. Wow. They didn't call England in? Why would you not call England in? I don't know. But Aragon has some problems Yes, this right is now. a chance to get to Louis and... Sardinia. Say that again? Or Sicily. Uh, I guess. This is a chance to take. Okay, England did come into the war. Good. Hmm, we don't have a mission to kick them out anymore, but uh, we do have a mission to integrate Ferrara. Her. I think I'm going to wait for that mission to show up where we can kick them out. Austria is sieging my land. I don't care. As long as that box is not checked, it um, doesn't matter. This lag is bad. What the hell, game? Yeah, we can ferry some idiots over to Sardinia. That's true. Don't forget about Malta. Mm, yeah. I converted Liguria, so let's go ahead and core what we can't. Oh, we're at war with somebody who has a core on it. Really? Genoa joined? Yeah, Genoa joined. Great. Where's our boats? Let's get six guys on the boat. Should be fine. Then we can go to Malta as well.
Alright, invade all the things. The one shitty part is we have no manpower at all. Tons of free diplomats. Let's get relations back up with Savoy. And France. Burgundy. Saxony. Wow, Messina fell already. Wow, that was quick. Now these we can make them give to uh, our vassal Naples, so that's nice. I'm not sure how much we'll have to siege to be able to do that though. Hopefully it'll fall soon here. We can get these troops home. our war score right now? Probably pretty low. 11%. Wow, that's bad. They will give Calabria away. What about Messina? No. If I wanted to do all that, I'd have to do 74%. Holy shit. And nobody has a core on Naples except them. So yeah, 74% is just not achievable because Castile is going to have all this war score. Castile is the war leader. See? But we can do just Calabria, I guess. Better than nothing. User in your channel timed out. User entered your channel. Wow, this is one chaotic war. I like that the Catholic League is winning, though, right? <laughs> Against Aragon's idiotic Protestant friends. So we're up to 12%. Wow. So he'll do Calabria, but that's it. I mean, that's probably the best deal we can hope for, really. Let's just do that. You know what I would love to do is have him get rid of his alliance with Austria. Shit, that would be nice. Get him to revoke cores on Provence. He doesn't have any cores on Provence.
Okay, now Castile's not going to like that we got a separate piece, but oh well. I do have to go right now. The pizza's here, so I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.